Hello and welcome to Home with Sarah Jane. Today I wanted to share what I got other people, like family and friends, um, what I got them for Christmas. So if you are new here, hello, welcome. My name is Sarah and I'm a homeschooling mom to two girls, ages 10 and 13. And normally I share about homeschooling and homemaking on this channel. So if you are interested in that, stick around. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for stopping by once again. I do really appreciate you taking time to spend with me. So now I already um, uploaded my video about what I got my husband, what I got my kids and my pets and um, even our stocking stuffers. So this is actually going to be gifts that I give to like nieces, nephews. Um, this year, my brother and my sister, we decided that we're going to give gifts to each other to each other. So this is also what I got my adult siblings. Um, so yeah, I even bought gifts for their pets that will be here on Christmas. So even my siblings pets are getting <laughs> a Christmas gift from me this year. Um, well, not this year, we usually do that. But my brother and sister are usually here not usually always my brother and sister are always here on christmas um they're here the night before they're here the moment we we all open our eyes on christmas day so i just love to make sure that everybody that's going to be here christmas morning is going to have a gift so that is why i even included their pets but let's just get right into it so man it's hot in here i had to turn off my fan because it was making too much noise and now I'm like, <laughs> anyway, let's just get to it. So, okay. Um, so my best friend and I, my BFF, as I call her, um, we've been friends for like 20 years and her kids call me auntie and my kids call her auntie. And so um, this year, my best friend actually uh, has three more girls that are added to her family. So I have three new nieces this year. And um, I'm really excited to actually meet them. We live about an hour away from each other, so it's kind of hard to get together. Um, so I haven't met them yet, but they are 10, 8, and 4. So I wasn't quite sure <laughs> um, what to do because my best friend, um, she also has my goddaughter, AJ. She calls me her fairy godmother. And she also has my nephew, Nathan, that I shop for as well. So right now, my best friend has, well, not right now, my best friend has five kids. And three of them I haven't met yet. So I didn't know quite what to get um, for those little girls. But because I've had girls, you know, I have two girls, um, I kind of did like a, a, a guess. And I figured I'd get them cutesy stuff. So I'm going to insert a picture of the box that I'm going to be presenting to them with the gifts inside and I'll show you individually what gifts they um, that I purchased. So each girl is going to get a cute little fuzzy diary and this does have the little lock and it's really soft and it's cute. I thought that this one was adorable. So I picked up this one and then I picked up this one. Now I actually picked this same one up for my youngest as well I just thought it was super cute um it's like rainbow and it's soft and squishy and it has this little pouch in the front and again these are just little cute diaries and then here's another one this one is so adorable yeah I went a little crazy I think with the diaries but they're cute and little girls love diaries and then this one it's cute because it's like a little you could take the little jacket or whatever, it's like a pineapple or something. And then to go with each of those diaries, I picked up a set of glitter markers so that they would have special pens to write in those diaries. Now, I actually, um, I've purchased these pens before. I actually bought, I think, four, four or five of these uh, for just my kids because my kids go through pens like crazy. But these are just glitter gel pens. Um, and it's like a 30, it's a 30 pack of jitter, jitter, uh, of glitter gel pens. Um, my kids really enjoyed them. And I thought that these little girls would love sparkly writing in their diaries. So to add to those, because I don't know, I just, I don't know why I just kept going. So I just kept shopping. I picked up these little, um, they're not caboodles, Canoo caboodles, canoodles, caboodles. I can't even remember the name of them now it's to hold like jewelry or like little um, makeup things. So I picked these up. I got one for each of them. It has a mirror inside, but inside I decided to add in a little, let me do this the right way, 
a little necklace ring and bracelet set for each little girl and then I also added in some hair accessories so that's for one of the girls and then for the next girl again it's just one of these little containers and then they have their little necklace set this one's unicorns and then their hair accessories I'm dropping everything okay which one's this oh this one's super cute it's a little pink butterfly and then again some hair accessories and I don't I don't pay full price for anything so um, I bought these when they were on a buy three get three free and also only a dollar per item so that's how I was able to get so many little things and then the last one little butterfly necklace some more hair clips and then because I just didn't stop buying things, I also picked up a couple of other little things for the girls. Um, I picked up just her own little cute brush. So one for each of them. I should probably pull the dog hair <laughs> out of them before I give them. Um, not that I brushed my dog with these brushes. It's just I have a great Pyrenees and his hair gets everywhere. So yeah, so I picked these up to put in their little bag. And then I also picked up four of these cute little cupcake lip balms. Um, I did not get anything that has color to it, you know, because these girls are 10 and under and, you know, some people don't like that. So um, I picked up these little cupcake lip balms. And then the last thing I'm going to be adding to their little um, like gift box is a set of nail polish. So I picked up this one. And then I picked up three, so, you know, here they are. I picked up three of these ones. Um, they didn't have four of these. That's why one of them is a little different. But these ones are just kind of like a glitter polish to where these ones have a little bit more color to them. So that is what I got for those girls. And then also for another, I picked up this Barbie color reveal. Um... Yeah, so <laughs> it's a Barbie color reveal. Sorry, I've, I've got so much going on right now. I just keep on like zoning out. But yeah, so <laughs> this part, the part B, this Barbie color reveal. And then, um, oh, I do always, when I go places for Christmas, um, I do, <laughs> sorry. Um, when I go places for Christmas, I do always travel with an extra gift for a little girl, a little boy, a teenager, and then a couple or like an adult. I do always travel with extra gifts. Um, it doesn't mean that I will give the gifts, you know, just because, but it's more like if I go somewhere and I was unaware that somebody was going to be there and I give everybody else a gift, except for this one person, it kind of makes me feel bad. So, and I just, I don't like that. So what I do is I just, I travel with a couple of extra goodies in the trunk of my car <laughs> so that I'm not put in that, that situation. So for my extra gift in case, you know, a little girl shows up or a little girl comes to my house or I show up somewhere with, you know, a, a child I didn't know was going to be there, I picked up this tie-dye kit. So this is really cute. I feel like this this is um, a good gift for like a wide range of children or little girls. But the reason why I say little girls is because this is more like a hair tie and um, like a headscarf and stuff like that. So that's why I picked this one up for like an emergency backup gift for a little girl. Now, moving on to nephews, um, I have two older nephews um, in high school. And I just picked up these van, what is it, vans? Yeah, these vans, like long sleeve jacket things. Um, I thought that these were really nice. It has a hood, they button up. So I picked up one of these in this like, it's like a blue gray, almost like a blue gray black. 
Um, I thought that this was really nice. And then for my other nephew, I picked him up the same thing, only in a different color. Um, yeah. So this one, it's coming off more yellow than it actually is. It's kind of more of like a brown. Um, but again, it's just a Vans hooded, like, little jacket um, that buttons up or button up. I, I'm, I don't know. Is it a jacket? Is it a really thick shirt? I don't know, but I thought it was nice. And my husband said he think the boy he thinks the boys would like this. So yeah, I picked these up for them. Now for my younger nephew who has all of those sisters, I picked him up because because I got the girls like a little beauty kind of you know set with diaries and pens. Um, I picked him up just a few toys. So I picked him up this Hulk. What are these called? Jiu Jitsu. Goo Jitsu? Is it Goo Jitsu? I'm not sure. Um, so I picked this up. But basically it's like a Stretch Armstrong Hulk. He stretches. So I picked him up this. And then, oh gosh, how old is he? Is he seven? Six? Seven? I think he's six. His sister's nine. Okay, that doesn't matter, but he's little. <laughs> he's a little boy. I also picked him up this Pokemon thing. I don't know. It clips onto your belt. My best friend says that he likes Pokemon. I know nothing about Pokemon. So, um, yeah, it's just like this thing that clips onto his belt. So I was like, okay, sure. And then I just picked him up this dart gun. And then for the extra gift for a little boy, just in case, you know, I'm put in that position, um, I did pick up... I don't know if I could grab it. It's the same Nerf gun that I got my nephew but i picked up just an extra nerf gun this is a dart gun am i saying nerf because this isn't technically nerf brand anyway i picked him up this dart gun uh, him oh my gosh redo okay so i picked up this dart gun in case i run into any um little boys or i mean even little girls like dart guns my kids love dart guns but in case there's a child that i come across that i didn't get a gift for dart gun extra gift now, um, for, sorry, I'm like all up in your face. Um, for my siblings, they are going to be bringing their pets along. And so that's going to be um, uh, two chihuahuas. And my sister has a great Pyrenees who's actually the brother to my dog. And then she's bringing a cat. So for the two chihuahuas, I picked up this little ramen and... Um, what is this called? A little ramen and uh, like over medium or sunny side up egg. The reason why I picked these ones up for those dogs, because I'm going to just split it and wrap them separately. Um, my brother is always eating ramen and he's always putting an egg on everything. So I just thought that this would be perfect to give to his pets. Um, so I picked this up for them. And again, I'm just going to split this one in half and just wrap these individually and give those to his um, dogs. And then for my sister's um, dog, Gus, he likes bright colored toys he loves like all the rainbow colors and you know all of that so I found this and I thought it would be perfect for him because he loves just rainbow and it has the crinkle yeah and it squeaks in the I hit myself in the face if you I don't know if you noticed I thought I'd let you know <laughs> um what was I saying it has squeakers in the clouds and then it's crinkly in the rainbow part so I just think that he'd really really like this so I got him this and then for my sister's cat, I know this seems like, <laughs> I know it seems weird, but I swear I, I even buy for my pets. So I bought my sister's cat this, um, it's upside down. Hang on. Okay. I bought this cardboard scratcher and it comes with some catnip like that you could sprinkle in there. I mean, this cat is probably close to 20 years old. Um, and I just love this cat. She's so adorable. Her name is Pico. But my sister's cat is just, she's like a member of the family, you know? So she comes everywhere with my, or she goes everywhere with my sister. Um, so I bought this little scratch pad for her. Now let's move on to my actual siblings. So because my siblings are going to be here for Christmas, um, like Christmas morning, they're, they're going to have a stocking as well. So I did get stuff for stockings as well, but let's start with their gifts. Um, Oh, and my brother's girlfriend. She will be here as well. So let's start with her. So what I picked up for my brother's girlfriend is this really cute bag. Um, this I know this is going to make me sound stingy and 
and greedy, but I almost bought her something else because I love this bag so much. But I said, no, you bought this for, you bought this for your brother's girlfriend. Give it to your brother's girlfriend. She really likes Hocus Pocus. So I just thought that this would be a, you know, a really cute gift for her. This came from Box Lunch and it's just, it's so cute. I want this bag, but it's the season of giving. So um, I am gonna give it to her. On the back it says, I put a spell on you. And then um, on one side it has Binks and on the other side it has Billy. Um, Billy? The zombie, yeah. So I just thought that this was super cute. I think that she's really gonna like this. I know one of the last times um, I was talking to her, she had taken my kids on a bike ride. Her and my brother took my girls on a bike ride and she didn't really have like a little mini backpack or a little bag or anything to put her phone in. Like that would be convenient for a bike ride. So I thought, oh my gosh, a little mini backpack would be super cute to give her since she likes to go on bike rides with my kids. That's where this gift came from. Okay, and then um, the next thing I picked up for her is just this um, butterfly body spray from Bath and Body Works. I really like this smell. It's very soft, but not. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. What's the scent? It says... Chemicals, chemicals, chemicals. No, I'm just kidding. It says... Oh, here it is. Raspberry nectar, iris petals, and airy vanilla. So... I just thought this one smelled really nice, so I decided to pick this up for her, and that's what I got for her. Um, when we decided to get gifts, my siblings and I decided to get gifts for each other, we decided we didn't want to go, like, crazy either, so um, we just are pick I picked up, like, a, a gift and then, like, a little mini gift for him. So for my brother, he's going to love this. And yes, my brother is in his 20s, his late 20s. <laughs> so he's not a child, but this would make an amazing gift for a kid. Um, I picked up this Avatar The Last Airbender Monopoly set for him. He's always playing board games like Monopoly and um, we're, uh, what is it, Upwards and uh, Dabble and games like that with my girls. So I picked him up this special Monopoly for him. I think it's so cute. Um, he is a big, well, we all are pretty much in this house, but we're big fans of Avatar The Last Airbender. But, you know, the cartoon, not the movie. And um, we're not really huge fans of Korra, but this show with Aang, <laughs> we really like it. So, yeah, so I got this one for him. I think he's just going to love it. So this is kind of like his main gift from us. And then I picked him up this little mini dart gun. He does still play dart guns with my kids. Um, sometimes he shoots them at me when I get and I get mad at him. <laughs> I'm trying to cook or something. But yeah, so I picked him up this little mini dart gun. I actually picked up a couple of these for my girls as well. And I could already see the wars and battles that are going to be happening <laughs> between them with this. Okay, and now for my sister, my older sister, I picked her up a couple of things. Um, the first thing... I should have had this unwrapped, sorry. But the first thing that I picked up for her... Do you ever, like, get irritated with the amount of packaging <laughs> that is on an item? Because I do. Um, anyway, besides the point. I picked her up this... She's a Beetlejuice fan. So I picked her up this Recently Deceased, or Handbook for the Recently Deceased, purse. So this is a... Um, what is it called? A is it a cross bag? Is that what they're called? I I'm, drawing, I'm drawing a blank. But I picked up this bag for her. Yeah, it's a cross bag. So it's just on a little chain. I mean, she's going to love it. She's a big fan of uh, Beetlejuice. And I just thought that this was so adorable. And this bag was actually a little hard to come by. Like, I think that they were only selling it around Halloween or they sold out or something. But I'm just, I'm glad I was able to get one. I did pick this up at Hot Topic. Um, but, you know. I don't know if it's still available. It's just a really cute bag. So I picked her up this. That's her like main gift. And then for her small gift, I picked her up. No, not that. I picked her up. What did I pick her up? I keep on saying it. And then I, I picked her up this Rose Bath and Body Works spray. She does really like this scent. This isn't like something I just picked for her. I know that she wears this. Yeah, it's a very, it's, it's very obviously floral. It's a rose. Hello. But anyway, <laughs> um, it's a very nice scent. So I did pick this up for her. Those are her main gifts. Now, 
I'm going to share with you what I'm going to be putting in their stockings. So my brother, his girlfriend, and my sister will all be here, like I was saying, for Christmas. So they will all have a stocking. So in my sister's stocking, I am going to break this apart and just add these pieces into her stocking. I like to give useful gifts um, in an adult stocking. So um, I picked up this razor set that I'm going to be breaking apart and adding to her stocking. And then for her socks, I always give socks in a stocking. I actually picked her up two pair because I couldn't find like a pack of socks that I liked for her. But I picked her up these Star Trek socks. She is a fan. Um, so I did pick these up for her. And then also these were on clearance and I picked them up last year at Target and I just hung on to them. Um, but these are like really long, like up to the knee knit thick socks and I don't know if you could pick up the color but it's a really pretty blue um she likes uh she'll wear like leg warmers and and high socks and I just thought that she'd really like this and and I actually really like the color blue on her so I mean I got the color based on what I like for her or on her I guess you can say and then another thing I got for her stocking I'm trying to pull it all out is I got her some hair charms some hand sanitizer. This is like a spider web bracelet. I picked her up one of these, um, it's like a keychain band-aid holder. And then I picked her up this like hair, it's not a hair needle, <laughs> it's not a hair needle. What is this called? It's a hair thing. It's to hold up your hair. Pin? I don't know. It's it's to hold up your hair. So I got her one of these. And then um, she got an M&M candy cane. So I do always put in um, a toothbrush and floss. I just haven't picked those up yet. But that's what I'm going to be putting in my sister's stocking. Let me move all this. Okay, now for my brother and his girlfriend. Oh, I can't reach. My brother, no matter what, <laughs> on Christmas, always gets Tootsie Rolls. So this year for his Tootsie Roll candy, I found this big one. And, you know, it has a whole bunch of the little ones inside. But I found this really big Tootsie Roll pack. So I'm going to be putting this in his stocking. And then for his socks, I found these Zuko socks. I love them. Or Fire Nation socks because the other side is Fire Nation. So I found these. I, ha I found these at five below and I haven't seen them since and I haven't been able to find them online again because I wanted to actually pick up another pair, but I'm just going to keep on trying to hunt some more down. But yeah, so I picked these ones up for my brother and then he also got his M&M candy cane and I got him this, um, these are playing cards, but it's a PlayStation, what is this one? It's a PlayStation set. Of playing cards so I just thought that these were fun and again he likes games so I think that he's gonna love this card set and then my brother also loves to read so I've bought so many of these rubber chicken bookmarks so I bought two for my girls originally and then I bought one for my husband or I bought one for my husband and then I bought two more for my girls and then I was like you know I'm gonna buy another one and give it to my brother so now I've, <laughs> I've, I've purchased like so many of these rubber chicken bookmarks but look how cute that is it's a rubber chicken like who wouldn't like a rubber chicken bookmark it's just goofy you know and then for his girlfriend her stocking for oh and again my brother will have floss and a toothbrush inside his stocking and then for his girlfriend i picked up these for her socks these are like those really soft cozy almost like slipper socks i just thought that these were fun um so and they're really comfy so I did pick these up for her and then to go in her stocking her playing cards I picked I gotta pull the tag off I don't care if you guys see it but like <laughs> I don't want her to see it um I picked up these crisp now it's stuck to me I picked up these crystal playing cards for her I picked her up some hand sanitizer some nail stickers 
one of those hair things again. What is it called? I can't remember. Are they just hairpins? I feel like I'm making that up. I don't know. I picked her up this little Bath and Body Works hand lotion. This one just says um, dry hand relief. Um, and I don't think there's a scent to it. I was trying to find something kind of neutral. Well, I guess no scent would be neutral. Oh, okay. And then now my kids actually picked this out for her. Um, she likes pandas. So my kids picked out these panda bookmarks. Now, my kids have these same bookmarks and they really like them. They're the magnetic ones. So when my kids seen these, when I bought them for them, um, they were like, oh my gosh, we should get this for, you know, Amanda. She would love these. So I bought another, another pack of panda bookmarks for her. And I think that is it. Okay. No, it's not. I'm lying. Hang on. Let me get this all back over here. Okay. My foot is asleep. I need to stretch. Okay. Um, again, so I showed you the, the extra gifts that I got for kids just in case um, I go somewhere and I didn't get a gift for a kid. Now, for teenagers or young women, young ladies, um, I always travel around with a couple of extra bottles of Bath & Body Works body mist or body spray. Fragrance mist. Fragrance mist? Fine fragrance mist. So I picked up an extra champagne toast in case I run into any young ladies that I, don't, I didn't get a gift for originally. Um, so that one's champagne toast and this one is vanilla bean noel so yeah I know it seems kind of weird to travel around with extra gifts in the back of my car but it just makes me feel better I really don't like to exclude or forget anybody um, especially with how my mind is I, <laughs> I forget things two seconds later for teenage boys um or for men, I mean, this would work for women as well, obviously, but for teenage boys and men, I usually just have some kind of wacky sock or fun sock. So this is a pack. So I feel like when you get them in like a three pack or, or more, it just makes it like a more complete gift. I mean, one sock is fine too. I mean, one pair of sock is fine too, but um, I, I found these um, Nightmare Before Christmas socks and I just thought that they were cute. So, I mean, they could be any fun wacky socks um now for um couples that I maybe forgot or didn't know they were going to be there I always travel around with an extra couple of bottles of homemade vanilla so these I will travel around with I actually made this vanilla almost a year ago yeah and I bottled it up now I will shrink wrap this um bottle and put a tag on it and then give it you know as a gift so yeah, I always travel with a couple of extra bottles of vanilla just in case. And then also like a lot of my in-laws, like my sister-in-law, she likes to bake a lot. So she'll be getting like vanilla from me as a gift. Um, and then for like everybody else, um, like if I'm going somewhere, I like to travel with little goodie boxes as well. So I'll make a whole bunch of treats and that's what I usually give to in-laws and um you know other family members like aunts and uncles and these are just cute boxes that i bought from the dollar tree that i put those goodies in and then um for like grandparents and for my aunt and my uncle that we are very close to i usually get personalized gifts so yeah um like they will i think my aunt and my uncle they always get a calendar um with all my kids pictures in it uh, every year at Christmas and then my kids will make them a gift and then their grandma they made her something and they haven't told me if they wanted to get her anything else or not they usually pick the item that they give to them and then there is their grandfather uh, my father-in-law that we usually will do something like a calendar or a specialized mug or something like that so I think that's everything I'm sorry I felt kind of chatty today and I felt like all over the place but I hope I gave you some ideas that you can use. Um, this is everything that I got for our family and friends. And um, also I do occasionally have a couple of extra gift cards on me like to Amazon or just like a Target gift card or something like that just in case. But yeah, I'm the type that likes to have extra gifts. So if you have any questions, please leave it in the comment section. Thank you so much for stopping by. You have a great day. Bye.